um, in the in the three separate markets that you're in, um, how have you tried to differentiate your stores uh, from the other laundromats that uh, may be in those markets? So the one of the stores is not a quick wash brand. It's actually an older it's an older store that's an unattended um, in a lease space, and that's one that I still keep. And that's actually a store that doesn't have great parking and, and things like that. And we've been able to kind of figure it out, but it's it's upside is limited because of that. But mm -hmm. um, when you're with a new store, and this is why I love building new right now, is it's just, it's so easy to make something different that's not there. So you can build a store, um, put the big machines close to the door. You can have them facing the windows if you want. You can make sure that or try to have to the best of your ability, depending on the layout of the store, but you want, you know, can I do seven foot wide aisles between or eight or nine foot aisles? Um, I like to have tables with sitting, kind of like restaurant seating, which a lot of people like kind of the airport type seating. And I'm not a big fan of that. I like it where people can bring a computer and the children can do their homework and they're sitting there and they're more comfortable um, right. so they're in creating spaces for that. And then, you know, having an area for, um, for the, the children's area and for the children's books. And, um, mm -hmm. it just, that kind of the older laundromats where they would put the big machines in the back and it's a skinny, narrow store and there's not as much parking. It's just mm -hmm. kind of, it's really easy to, to, uh, create a different environment when you're building new, you can just, you can just however you can imagine imagine it that's what you can do and it's there's a lot of great stores right. out there so there's a lot of good ways to to find little cool things to put in your store um right but there's so many things that we do differently you know polished concrete floors you know yeah. stainless steel duct work you know spiral yeah. ducting tons mm -hmm. of stainless machines touch screens having apps having card systems there's so mm -hmm. many things you know just having staff there being nice keeping the store clean Mm -hmm. um and just having it look really modern um right. those are all just great things that you can do in a new store right so, and you can right. do that in a retool and other things too but it's, it's just a little more challenging yeah it's a little tougher when you have the confines of uh an existing store and an existing layout uh that may not yeah. work with uh i guess your vision so but uh yeah, yeah no that, that's uh, that's great stuff